everyone in previous classes already we are discussed about the thomson model of an uh, structure of an atom and the rutherford's models regarding to the structure of an atom and you know about the where the thomson model fails to explain the structure of an atom and where the rutherford uh, fails to explain the structure of an atom so next what happened next bohas will come and he gave his postulates and his uh, ideas regarding about the structure of an atom by developing the postulates of rutherford model and uh, in today's class i wish to discussing about the the what factors helps to give the postulates to the bohar to explain the structure of an atom so see here in today's class i wish to discuss about the developments leading to the bohar's model of an atom which development on what factor the developments are lead to bohar's model of an atom so see here you already know uh, in beginning classes or in your earlier classes the all objects in this universe either it may be a living organism or it may be a non living organisms so all organisms or all objects in the universe are made by the atoms so already you know that all objects are made by atoms and next what he did the atoms are interacted with certain radiation or the atoms are interacted with a light so how the atoms are interacted with a radiation and how the atoms are interacted with a light by the help of by the uh, observation of the interaction of atoms with a light he proposed his theory but which factors are lead to that bohr's model that is the first factor dual character of the electromagnetic radiation dual character of the electromagnetic radiation so the word says the dual dual means the double so dual character of electromagnetic radiation means the electromagnetic radiations are electromagnetic radiations are behaves as a wave they possessed as a wave form and that electromagnetic radiations are in the form of particles also they behave as a particles also these electromagnetic radiation behaves as a wave and behaves as a particle also so these dual character of double character of electromagnetic radiations are leads to explain the bohr's model of an atom so how the wave character of the electromagnetic radiations are behave and what factors are helps to the bohr's model i will discuss with you uh, in a next class and how the particle manner electromagnetic radiations are help to lead the bohr's model atom uh, bohr's model of an atom that it also discuss in a second class so here see here in the second point the experimental results regarding to the atomic spectra so by the help of the atomic spectra so what do you mean by the spectrum spectra if you white light passes through the prism and then it scattered or divert as a seven light color so like this the experiment results regarding atomic spectra which can be explained only by assuming the quantized electric energy levels quantized electric electric energy levels in an atoms so by the help of these two facts so these two factors are lead to the developments lead to the bohr's model of an atom so these are the two points helps to the bohr to give his postulates in our next class i wish to discuss the dual character of an electromagnetic radiation as a wave as a particle